This is a 2011 Hurley Pro. Trestles is really that blank canvas. It's, it's built for creativity. At the end of the week, the best surfer would win. You know, it's an interesting time for surfing changing, the older guys being influenced by those young guys. John John's got a massive future and I really take my hat off to the kid, he really did well out there and a bit of pressure on me but it pulled through. Joel Parkinson, Julian Wilson there and Mick Fanning, it's going to be a cracker. Joel Parkinson, the number three surfer in the world, moves through into the quarterfinal. Joel, look at this. He's upset about the result. To surf against my heroes is one of the hardest things to do because you look up to them. I would come up against them and be like, hey mate. 8.17, Owen takes over the lead and takes the win from Mick Fanning. Joel Parkinson, Julian Wilson, it's going to be a big one. We can settle yesterday, I guess. <laughs> Joel Parkinson up against Julian Wilson. These two heated rivalry. All right, Julian Wilson into the semifinals. It is the battle of the young Australians. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Owen Wright, he takes it. They have called an interference on Julian Wilson, which is wow. He's so made six of the last seven finals out here at Lowers. Clearly the guy to beat. And the final has started. Looks like Kelly's going to edge out Owen and go left. Well, Kelly, the pressure is on here because I think Owen got the score, and Kelly's going to town behind him. Drama here at the end. It's a flip of a coin, and we're going to wait for the judge's call. And here comes Kelly scored. And once again, for the fifth time, first place trophy is collected by Kelly Slater. As far as this event goes, I think the best surfing in the world is on display this week. Surfing is well and truly on a new path and Kelly Slater is absolutely leading that charge.